Welcome to JSA TV, where we're covering the latest news stories and trends from within the digital infrastructure space. And we are coming at you live. That's right. We are live right now in beautiful Austin, Texas. And this good looking fellow to my right is Mr. Vincent Chan. Vincent is a member of the Data Cloud Talent in Tech program. And he is the lead product manager at Stoltz ATS. Vincent, welcome to JSA TV. Thank you. Very happy to be here. You, you bet. Uh, thank you. And um, we're very happy that you are here. So let's talk a little bit about talent in tech, specifically with regard to you, Vincent. Um, what exactly was it that inspired you to pursue a career in digital infrastructure? So uh, I kind of stumbled into this uh, A lot career. of us do. A lot yeah. of us do, Vincent. So uh, it just happened that Stoltz ATS was looking for a product manager that had enough technical skills and engineering mm -hmm. to work closely with the engineering team, and mm -hmm. I have it to fit the bill. And uh, yeah, shout out to my mentors at Stoltz ATS, <laughs> Lane Gregory, <laughs> Shane out. Meadows, David A3, James Tucker. Appreciate the help. Yes. Amazing. A yeah. shout out. We don't get too many of those, Vincent. But so um, so you, you stumbled into it, but you stayed it. You're, you've stayed here. Why? Yeah, well, it's uh, there's a lot of things happening every day. It's very exciting. Everything yeah. is changing. Everything is happening. You know, I kind of just, I'm just starting to understand, you know, the, the basic, the lowest levels. Yeah, yeah. And uh, being here today at, at Data Center Cloud, you know, really opens my eyes. You know, again, thank you to Susanna for the great opportunity to be here, to listen to the industry leaders here. You know, very helpful, very appreciate the opportunity. Okay, so if, if, I, if, I'm, uh, if I'm someone your age, and I come up to you and I say, Vincent, I don't know, I don't know about you know digital infrastructure. Um, tell me, should should I go into digital infrastructure? Uh, what would what would you say to them? And what would you say is the most important skill set as an entry level person to to get uh, to get in? So I'm definitely a fan of digital infrastructure. Me too. So uh, yeah, whoever I talk to, my cousin, I'm like, hey, you know, you want to yeah. come join this industry? Yeah. Oh, I love um, that. But I would say, you know, the number one skill is communication. So, you know, as a, as a young product manager in the thermal management, I would say, sector of the data center uh -huh, cloud, uh -huh. you know, there's, uh, you, need, you need both the soft skills, the business savvy, and also the technical skills to carry on meaningful discussions. Uh, you know, there's a lot of things happening. Everything is flying, you know, from the new NVIDIA uh, chip infrastructures, OCP, collaborative design, new yeah. regulations, new refrigerants, and, and, you know, new, new cash flow strategies, new capital strategies, and and everything from top to bottom, you know, supply chain, manufacturing, everything is moving, everything is changing, you know, uh, and a young product manager these days really needs, you know, to be able to focus on the detail while keeping an eye on the big picture. Yeah. Uh, he or she needs to manage the high emotions uh, while trying to say uh, some sort Such of a, a self composure. Yeah. Such a good point. Uh, and honestly, if it's, it, it is it is no mystery to me why Stoltz hired you right away. Uh, you're doing a, an amazing job, obviously. Um, but crystal ball time. Uh, Ten years from now, what changes do you hope to see within the industry? So I would say right now, you know, I'm still young. I'm still trying to figure yes. things out. You know, I, I've been reading, I've been seeing, you know, listening to the industry leaders here and there, but you know, as a naive young professional myself, you know, I would say closed loop, you know, integrating renewable energy into the system on the thermal management side, you know, increasing the efficiency, using more environmental friendly mediums, like a lot of trends that's already happening. Yeah. Um, and just continue to grow into that closed loop uh, ecosystem so that the data center becomes, you know, part of the world. And I would say environmental responsibilities, cultural responsibility aligns with capital um, initiatives. Yeah. Could not agree with you more on that point, Vincent. Thank you so much, and thanks for being with us. We appreciate it. I appreciate it. I appreciate the opportunity. Thank you. You bet. You bet. And thank you, viewers, for watching JSA TV. We'll see you real soon.